Hey guys, Josh here. We're up to something, guys. Got a little something uh, new for you, a new brand, um, Deluxe Wear. It's a brand that uh, I've been following for quite a while, and uh, we're excited to finally uh, get, get their, uh, their clothing in. Um, probably my favorite piece to the collection so far is this whip cord uh, jacket here. It's uh, two front pockets, also the side entry pocket. Um, it's got the raglan sleeve, triple needle stitch detail. It's made from a, uh, I want to say it's, I'll call it a micro whip cord, um, but they brush the interior. So for spring jacket, this is not a lined piece. It's got the snap closure and the zipper. What I really wanted to show y'all is the interior of it. Got that brushed interior with a, uh, a twill lining, actually a canvas line trim. This is an 18 and a half. I wear a 17 and a half. I'll show you all this one real quick. Wear either one. But I photoed the uh, 17 and a half earlier. Um, so perfect uh, spring coat. No top pockets, no interior pocket. Pretty simplified. Super soft interior. Three great colorways. Get your uh, khaki. Army black. Kind of like a dusky black color. And then I'm wearing the brown. Um, not that you want to chime in on any of your favorites? Yeah. I'm going to jump in. You saw kind of the beginning, Josh's favorite piece. I'm going to cover two more pieces before I get to my favorite piece. First off, beautiful plaid, very open weave, about five ounces, give or take. Uh, solid fit. Check out beautiful shell buttons. Has a ton of reflectivity in there. Pretty solid, not brushed, just a good lightweight plaid option for spring. That's, runner up for my favorite piece that's that's one of my favorites as so well. from the outside from a distance it looks like a hickory stripe denim getting close it is actually a flannel and i don't know if the camera can pick that up but along with the indigo rope dyed indigo you have these strips strands of almost like a deep purple color coconut buttons black and if we go to the inside a ultra luxe brush finish on that again work shirt silhouette you got the double flaps and this is a solid solid piece super soft can't wait to see broken in washed down i'm gonna finish it off my favorite piece the one that i'm wearing right now this is the 1940s inspired denim work shirt it's a 10 and a half ounce of denim single pocket lined with canvas we want to bring you something new. We don't have anything like this in the shop. This is brand new, along with a new brand. What makes it my favorite piece? The raglan sleeves drape so nice over the shoulders. We have a fly placket, hidden buttons, metal repro. Lean in, chin strap, more shell buttons on the collar line cuffs rope dyed canvas that will also fade with the rope dyed indigo denim and we also have the canvas lining in there check out the selvage detail down at the bottom inside the placket a beautiful different brand new piece something that we haven't had before different than everything else that we've had uh, these are all brand new solid pieces. Josh is bringing in the t-shirts right now. They also have loop wheel tees. He's going to cover that briefly and uh, we'll wrap this up. All right, so I'm wearing one of the colors. It's uh, hold this for me. So I'm wearing the, uh, the U.S. Large. This is a uh, like a silver color. Beautiful fit. Heavyweight. 
It's about an 11 ounce uh, t-shirt. We have it in a black and purple. Just saw him do a, a video of the, uh, the strength of the neck. They stretch it out, it's sitting on a mannequin. I mean, they pull on it, pull on it, threw it in the dryer, uh, put it back on the mannequin. It's back to perfect. Um, these are very durable clothes. Um, we, love, we love what they're doing. They got some beautiful looks. Um, excited to have them in. From what I understand, we're the only retailer in America. Um, so we're, uh, we're excited to have them. Uh, if you guys have any questions about them, everything will be measured. Yeah. Nothing seems like Quick it has note on sizing. It's a little bit different than anything else we've had. We have the Japanese sizes as well as the American sizes. It'll go large, extra large Japanese, then jump up. We'll have US medium, US large. All of the Japanese sizes will be smaller than the US sizes, so make sure you check the measurements. All of the measurements will be online. I am wearing a Japanese large right here. I'm 5'10", 150. The hoodies are a little bit different. They go by neck sizes, 16 and a half to 19 and a half. I know Josh was saying he was wearing a 17 and a half. Well, in the let photos, me try, I'll, try, a, I'll try the 17 and a half for you too. Yeah, um, but make sure to check our measurement chart. It's a little more confusing than anything else we have. Uh, you know, you may think that you're a large, you could be a US medium. I'm kind of right in between the two. Like I said, right now I'm wearing the Japanese large, but make sure you check those measurements because it is different and a different uh, a different layout than anything that we've had in the past. So this is a 17 and a half ounce, I'm sorry, 17 and a half inch um, overcoat. A little denim lining here. We will have their denim jeans in soon, um, but uh, we're excited to get what they can give us right away. But check us out. Hit us in the uh, comments below if you're not already. Subscribe to our uh, channel and uh, interact. We love uh, the feedback. We appreciate it, guys. Thanks.